Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Piping Welding Non-Destructive Examination Das and DD So this is my YouTube channel And I have also a Facebook page Piping Welding and DT Okay uh, So thanks for watching all my subscriber And to all my subscriber Just subscribe now Subscribe now Subscribe now so that you can update my old video about piping welding and dt okay so anyway i have an isometric drawing here okay i will give you uh, uh what is the information of this isometric drawing so we have a uh, information we have um line number uh orientation uh, norting okay support details material description okay uh revision number sheet number so this is it guys i will show you all so um, listen guys listen and watch and learn for this video so if you are uh, new you are new you are new in the piping or the pipe either so must watch this guys so in the um, uh, expert in the piping i think no need to watch this because this is a very a simple uh, if you are expert in the uh, isometric drawing okay so this is for you this is for you new okay let's start now guys so let's start for this uh, material description okay so this is uh, guys the material uh, description in the material description uh, they have number one this is the pipe okay see that so we have a pipe so we have they have a, a pipe bevelin seamless a106 schedule 20 okay so meaning this pipe is uh, carbon steel a106 is carbon steel they have also nps they have a material spec they have a material code quantity okay number two is uh, pipe also bevel and seamless a106 schedule 24 utility 8 inch v1 p1 and this is the material code quantity is 13.1 um, meter number three is a uh, centric reducer number four is 90 degrees elbow what is the size eight by six eccentric 90 degrees elbow eight inches number five is weld neck plants okay six inches uh, a105 is standard std and they have also material description for the pipe support so this is the pipe support material description eight inch and they have also a material code for the pipe support and we have also for this isometric drawing they have also a cut pipe length one and one half inch okay smaller pipe are only preferred so this is piece number one two three no one three five six seven so you will you, you can see this uh, number in the uh, this uh, line okay and this isometric so this is the length and PS remarks no piece length and PS okay and we have also this is um for construction so this is engineering stamp so if you will you, you see this for construction meaning this is released for uh, fabricating okay this pulling uh, erection so on and so on if you see this for construction okay we have also this is an uh, name of the camp uh, company refinery master plan to a special project group refinery master plan so i received the uh, logos okay so anyway forget about that and they have both this is the drawing number of this isometric id fnu ls 63018 mm. This is the line number. If you see this uh, size of the pipe, meaning this is the line number. Okay, we have also a sheet number. So this is the sheet number. Revision. 
revision okay check this revision always always check this revision why so why uh, example if you uh, hold this one this uh, uh, release this uh, your formal and your formal also not checking the revision number you're holding the you hold the old drawing okay and they have a new revision drawing for this isometric uh, drawing so meaning you are holding the old uh, isometric if you are not checking this revision if they have a new revision number okay so very important this uh, revision uh, number so example if you are publicating now uh, this in the pipe uh, in the publicating shop but uh, you are holding uh, all the draw all drawing this is a very big problem for the company okay the expenses of the company okay the manpower are uh, all low loses because you are not checking this revision number you are <clears throat> you are cutting this pipe but the cut uh, but the size of the pipe is wrong the orientation of the pipe uh, they have a new orientation so and so on and so on so this is a very big problem always check this revision okay because the piping uh, inspector they are uh, first is checking the documents okay they are always checking the documents and they are also checking this revision if you are uh, giving this in the pipings uh, in the inspector you are holding the old drawing so this is immediately rejected okay so always check the revision number so they have uh, also so this is the engineering signing this column so this is the engineering column so we have also a line data for rating design test isolation paint code so if rating is 345 kpa designs 517 so this is a test 812 kpa so this is the temperature okay <clears throat> and our test medium is water meaning this is a hydro tracer jacket none pwst no so rt radiographic is only five percent okay five percent in the shop five percent in the field okay so let's go for this line so we have so this uh, symbol is a psb pressure safety bulb so this is the symbol of psb size is six by four is nps so 801 this is the joint of this bolt so if you see this uh this uh, c continuation number so check the continuation number for this line so e n l so this is a uh, easting northing and elevation okay if you are um, yeah this is a uh, checking by if you are uh, um, always check this is thing not thing if you if you want to find this um, if you want to if you find this a uh, location of this uh, pipe check all always check this or thing not thing and also the elevation okay so this is joint number one this is a shop shop 12 joint number one joint number two okay number three so if you see this number three check in the material description so material description number three is eccentric reducer okay so this is how to read this isometric drawing and uh, 8 by 6 nps 25 mm offset plot side u okay so this is number one this this is the cut 
five plant number one. So, na piece number one four hundred ninety. So meaning this is a piece number one four hundred ninety. Okay, this is full, and this is number one in the material description. So this is the number one pipe pebbleless seamless A one o six. So so find this A one o six and this uh, and also does this material called find this pipe. Okay. So joint number ten. This all also a shop weld elevation number four. Check in the material description. So this is ninety degrees elbow number four. This one. Okay. And. This is a joint also, twelve, twelve best one. This is a joint, new joint number, twelve best one. This is the dimension. Okay, this F five. This is a flange. Check in the material description. So if you see the F W, this is a pill weld thirteen A. Okay, elevation fourteen A. So this is the joint support joint number. Okay, nine zero one nine zero two. This is the joint number. C detail B, C detail B. So this is a detail of this support. Okay, this is the support details of the for this pipe. Okay, so this pipe is C detail B. This is the detail B. And is ah if you see this arrow, the meaning this is a flow direction. Okay, flow direction of this. This is the arrow or meaning of flow direction. F W pill weld elevation E L. So check this number four in the material description. This is a ninety degrees elbow. Okay, this is a joint number zero three. Detail C. Check in the support details. So detail C. This is a welding type. So meaning this support is attaching on the five. Okay, so this one support. If you see this, the symbols. This is a support. So they have a two line there. So meaning this is a support. You see that symbol. So they have a twenty mm whip hole. The meaning this, they have a whip hole from this area. This is a bend, right? This is a pipe end. Meaning this is a bend. Okay, pipe end. No need or no more continuation. Okay, if you see this end and this arrow, meaning that this is going. This is orientation of northeen. This is the orientation of northeen. Okay. So, thanks for watching, guys. So that's all for now, and have a nice day. God bless, guys, and thank you. Bye bye. See you next time.